Hey Dazzlers, welcome back to my channel. I hope that you are safe and doing well. If you've been with me for a while, then you'll remember these really beautiful glam wall sconces that I made using inexpensive metal ribbon. In today's video, I show you another inexpensive lighting solution using that same metal ribbon. So if you're interested, then just keep watching. So the first thing I did was cut three pieces of my metal ribbon. I then used a combination of a strong adhesive and hot glue to glue all three of my pieces together. In my previous project, I used these really pretty acrylic gems from the Dollar Tree, but for this project, I've decided to use these 18 millimeter rhinestones that I picked up from Joann's. I could only find a few packages of those rhinestones on sale, so I also mixed in some of these bulk gems that I picked up from Hobby Lobby on sale some time ago. Next, I'm using some of the silver metallic 5x7 photo frames and mirrored ornate frames from Dollar Tree. I removed the contents from my photo frame and then I used Dollar Tree thumbtacks to attach my metal ribbon to my plastic frame. Originally, I simply folded the excess metal ribbon to the back of the photo frame, but eventually decided that it made more sense to cut off the excess instead. As you can see, I'm adding a small drop of hot glue to ensure that the thumbtack stays in place. I also added hot glue to the tips of the thumbtacks as well. I attached both ends of the metal ribbon to my frame. Next, I returned both the glass and the cardboard to my photo frame. I won't use the photo frame stand, so I simply removed it. I'm using this side hanging hook to hang my design on the wall instead. I 
I then removed the mirror from its ornate frame and I used a strong adhesive to attach the mirror to my design. To add just a bit more sparkle, I'm adding this decorative trim that I picked up from Hobby Lobby. I repeated those steps and made nine additional pieces. I'm using this color changing LED light as my lighting source. This light fits my design perfectly, but I'm adding small drops of hot glue just to make sure that it stays in place. I'm only using small amounts of hot glue so that I can easily remove the light to change the batteries when needed. Each of the lights comes with its own remote, but all of the lights can also be controlled with the same remote as well. To complete the project, I used a warm hair dryer to melt away my glue strings, and here's the finished look. These small wall sconces can be displayed separately or together. They were super easy to make and I think that they turned out beautiful. But what do you guys think? Let me know down in the comments. I would love to hear from you. I hope you enjoyed this week's video. If so, please like, comment, and share. And if you're new to my channel, please subscribe and be sure to turn on your notifications so that you don't miss my next video. Remember, I upload new videos every single week. So until next time, Dazzlers, bye.